What up guys, this is Taylor and today I've got a normal commentary for you guys. Uh, as usual, you can ignore, ignore, you can ignore, you can egg nor I don't even know what that is, but you can ignore the gameplay in the background. It's a 44 and 7 domination, second round I believe on the map. Uh, or f little first round and a second round on the map. I, I don't even remember the name of this map because it's been so long. But uh, so anyways, today I wanted to do something a little different. It's going to be a little series that I'm starting up. And I'm going to be calling it uh, Video Game Flashbacks. And so the first game I'm going to be, and basically this is going to be a series if you're new here. Uh, this is going to be a series where I discuss flashbacks to video games that I really enjoyed and I think a lot of people really enjoyed and so today is gonna be probably one of the most exciting one of the best video games of all time one that I I've loved forever this video game I still play it to this day it's so good in fact yesterday I went out and bought one of the old originals because I wanted to play it so badly it's just such a fun game uh, and now as you can tell by the title this game is Pokemon. So if you've never played Pokemon, you're really missing out. Even if you're in your teens, your late teens, your 17, 18, 19, hell, even if you're in your 20s, I would still recommend, if you're any sort of gamer, going and playing Pokemon. Now, I started out, I'm going to be telling a story of how I started out, but you can start out on the originals, like yellow, crystal, um, blue, red, on those originals, or you can jump into the third gen, which was sapphire, ruby, emerald, uh, or you can jump into 4th gen, diamond, which is all, 4th gen is when the DS really started, that's when it kicked off, that's when, uh, uh, diamond came out, pearl came out, platinum, and now of course there's black, white, black 2, black, white, or white 2, and then X and Y coming out later this year. So, my story of how I got started into Pokemon was, my parents really did not want me to actually play Pokemon, they said it was too violent of a video game. And, or that's what my mom said. She didn't want me to play it. And so I was really bummed, you know. My, I had a friend, uh, I'm going to call him Jeff, just for safe, just for safety's sake, so I don't actually say his name. But So Jeff and I, would we would hang out a lot. And I'd go over to his house a lot, and we went to school together, and he had Pokemon. And he had more than one now. So he would let me borrow it when I would come over, and we could play uh, together. And I could play on his account, and, and I just loved the game. I loved it so much. And now Jeff knew that, and he was a really good friend of mine. I really don't know why I lost touch with him. He, he was a good friend of mine. And uh, his mother actually, one day, one day, Jeff came over to my house. We were swimming, and we were like, I don't know, eight at the time or something. We were in my backyard swimming, and his mother came to pick him up because obviously we're eight years old. We can't drive at that point. And she brought me over my first Pokemon game. And now my mother didn't object because, you know, it was a gift. She didn't want to intrude on the gift. And it was Pokemon Sapphire. And now to this day, Sapphire has become my favorite Pokemon game of all time. Sapphire is just so... I love it because I played the absolute shit out of that game. Uh, I eventually, you know, I legitly leveled up my Swampert to level 96. Which is ridiculously hard to do if you know anything about Pokemon. I had a Swampert level 96. And I actually had a... And I was so into the game that I had a ditto... And I had a ditto go in from uh, DJ or Jeff's. His uh, he had Leaf Green and Fire Red, so he could get a ditto. And he traded me over a ditto, and I put him in the daycare center. And uh, I, I got another Mudkip, so I eventually had two Swampers. One was level like 50 something, and one was level uh, 96. And and I would battle my friend Jeff. I'd pl I'd battle him a lot. And but he had a Skeptile, and if or a Skeptile, I'm not entirely sure how you pronounce that. But if you guys know anything about uh, Pokemon, you know that Skeptile just absolutely raped Swampert, so I would just get destroyed every time, but you know, it was still, still so, so, so much fun. Eventually, you know, I got Fire Red, I never got really got into Leaf Green, although I rather would have had a Sand Slash versus whatever you got in Fire Red. If you know anything about Pokemon, you'll know what I'm talking about. And uh, so I eventually moved into Fire Red, I played that, I did not like it as much, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't like it as much as Sapphire Ruby, and then after Fire Red, Emerald came out and I loved that game once again. You know, that game was just so much fun again, and it was even cooler because you could get Groudon and Kyogre in the same game, it was just awesome. After that, Diamond and Pearl came out. Now I got Diamond because I didn't want that Palkia dragon looking thing, I, I just didn't enjoy it too much, you know, I didn't, I didn't like that guy. So I got Diamond. And I played the crap out of that game. That was my first Pokemon DS game and my real first uh, DS game in general. I really, really enjoyed that game. I'm, I'm not even entirely sure why. It was just so much fun. 
And uh, so after that game, I got Platinum, which was the next one to come out, which was a, it was kind of like Emerald. It was a combination of Diamond and Pearl, except it added in a new feature, Giratina. Um, I'm not actually sure if, if Giratina was in Diamond. I, I, oh, yeah, he was. You could get him, but he was more of a side Pokemon. He wasn't the main guy, uh, whereas in Platinum, he is the main guy. And uh, finally, you know, after Diamond and Pearl, Black and White came out. I ended up getting Black because I wanted the White Reshiram. And, you know, I really didn't like Black and White too much. I, I honestly didn't. I felt it had no endgame uh, whatsoever. I didn't even bother getting Black and White 2, which is unheard of for me because I'm such a Pokemon fan and I love getting all those games. And it's really unheard of for me not to get a Pokemon game. And so not getting Black and White really shows that I that I feel that the series is not going anywhere. I feel that I, ho I really hope X and Y does something new because I'm getting that. I just picked up my 3DS yesterday and I'm excited for X and Y. Anyways, guys, I hope you all enjoyed that. If you did, please make sure to leave it a like. Subscribe if you're new. Leave it a like because, you know, it's free. Subscriptions and likes are free. So why not? It helps us out as commentaries and commentators, and we really do appreciate it. So anyways, let me know uh, if you guys have any suggestions for the next uh, flashback that you guys want me to talk about. If not, I have something in mind that I think you guys will really enjoy. Anyways, hope you all enjoyed, and I will talk to you all later.